Hey, hey, what's up everybody? It's cold outside. I'm wearing my hat because I have to go right after I do this video. Um, but I wanted to make a video and I wanted to draw snowflakes. Uh, it's, there's a lot of snow everywhere. Yesterday I walked to the shop. Um, I'm gonna put my glasses on. I have to sit down because yesterday I walked to the shop in my big boots and I use muscles on my legs that I have not used in a long time and I can't feel my leg. The back of my knees hurt so much. It's, uh, I, I can't describe it. It's unbelievable. Um, okay, so, uh, snowflakes. No snowflake, no uh, snowflakes are alike. Uh, there's not, uh, I don't know how to say it. They don't uh, have the same exact snowflake more than once. That's what someone told me when I was a kid. So I wanna draw snowflakes my own way. Uh, essentially, I hope you can see this paper. Uh, essentially a snowflake, let me start with a crayon, is like a center shape, like maybe an octagon or a star shape or something. I'm doing it darker than I'd like to because I want you to see it. You should start with a light color. And so you color in the shape like this, and then you take like the center of that shape and you just basically draw a line up, draw a line down, draw a line this way, draw a line this way, and then uh, draw a line at an angle, draw a line at an angle, draw a line at an angle, draw a line at an angle. And that's it. After that, you have fun. You do different things. I'll put a circle here like this. And whatever I do over here, I'm going to do it over here. Uh, and then I put, uh, I'll put a triangle over here. Why not? And then I'll go over this side and I'll put an upside down triangle. I really hope you can see this. Luke's not here to zoom in. Um, and anyway, you just kind of have fun like this. You go from the center, I'll go here and I'll go like a squiggly thing. And then over here, I'll go here and I'll do a squiggly thing. And then I'll put uh, like a thing like this, a thing like this, and a thing like this. And then I'll do this on the same side. So whatever you do on one side, do it on the other side. Eventually you'll darken your thing and it's gonna start looking like a snowflake. Or not, I don't know. And I'll put a circle here and a circle here. And then I'll put a, what should I do? I'll do this kind of thing, a, squ a squiggly line. A squiggly line because no snowflakes are the same. So I'm making my own snowflake. This is my snowflake. I love it. Um, I'm going to change the color. I should use different kind of things like a pencil maybe. Yeah, yeah, that's better. See that? I don't know if you can see that. If you've been watching any of my videos, you know I like to use all different kinds of materials and kind of scribble scrabble in there. Uh, and I'll do this. And then I'll do something over here like I'm going to draw this line with a marker. This is a cool kind of I don't like these marks. Stabilo? I don't know how to say it. And I'm going to go like that, 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 that. And I'll do this, 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 this. It might take 45 minutes to an hour for it to start really looking like a snowflake. Um, but it'll eventually look like a snowflake. I'll put little circles in here. Because this is a microscopic circle. You can't tell me that this is not a regular snowflake. Snowflakes could certainly look like this. You have no idea. If every snowflake is not the same, why isn't this possibly a real snowflake. Uh, let's see, I'll put little bubbles here, why not? I have to blow my nose soon. And I gotta go, I gotta go pick up Lachlan at school. So I have to make this video short and I'm gonna keep working. Oh my gosh, I really have to blow my nose. Hold on a second, I gotta blow my nose. It's all the uh, cold weather. Okay, I'm gonna blow my nose and I'm gonna throw out the tissue in the garbage. Uh, and then I'll do like this, I'll do 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 this. Whatever you do on one side, do on the other side. I'm not loving the snowflake, but it's not bad. Um, let's see, I'll do uh, another thing like that. See, now it's starting to really look like a snowflake. And I'll go like that, and then I'll take this tool, which is a marker, and I'll make more little lines like this. Look at this. And whatever I do on one side, I got to do it on the other side. It's a little difficult to think through these things, but it's actually a good practice for you to do this. So make a snowflake, make 10 snowflakes, make a bunch of snowflakes. I wanted to make a big one, but I want to make a whole collage of snowflakes. But I'm not going to be able to do that right now on this video because I got to go pick a block one. But look, why not do this? I'm going to keep working on a snowflake. I'm going to make a snowflake so intense. I'm going to do... Uh, a little thing like this, a little thing like that. That's kind of weird looking. But look at my snowflake, it's so good. Um, I think I need to darken this. Or maybe I know what to do. I need a darker color. Shoot, here it is, here it is. I'm gonna draw a circle, and I'm gonna do this kind of stuff. That's what I'm looking, look, a spider web. 
You see that? You're not gonna see this, I promise. You'll probably see this. I don't know if you can see this. And I don't know if I'm on the camera. Oh, this is hard to do without someone behind the camera. Maybe you're not seeing anything, but see that? I'm doing like a little spider web in there. You probably can't see it. It doesn't matter. Just do that. Just do a bunch of lines. It's, it's called symmetry or uh, reflection. Um, I don't know what it's called. Anyways, do this. This is fun. Make a snowflake and show it to me, please. I want to see your snowflakes because maybe I'll cut this snowflake out. Maybe if you draw a snowflake, we can put a bunch of snowflakes up in the shop here. You want to draw me a snowflake? You want to draw me a snowflake and I'll put it up in the shop? It's going to be cold for a while. Maybe we all draw these cool paper snowflakes and then I'll take a... I'll use green. I'll take a... I'll cut... This green line is not part of my snowflake. This is the line I'm going to show you. I'm going to cut around it. I don't know. Something like that. And then I'll put like a little hole here and I'll put a string on it and I'll hang it. Except then I'll have to draw it on the other side too. Well, we'll think about this. This is not a bad idea. Uh, it's a little more involved than I thought because I forgot I have to draw on the back. Unless I just put them up on a wall. All right. Just draw the snowflake for now. Don't worry about having it be in the shop. Let's just focus on one thing at a time. Let's draw snowflakes. Oh my gosh, I'm using the green color. I wanted to keep it in blues. Um, maybe I could even draw like this kind of thing. Yeah, this is starting to really look like a snowflake now. Do you feel the coldness of this snowflake? I didn't like that, what I just did. I'm gonna go back, bop, 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 because you know, it crystallizes as it goes away from the center. So you'll get more like dots like this from what I understand. Um, I haven't been uh, studying snowflakes for a while, but I'll look it up and see if I'm right. But I've seen stuff like that. That's kind of interesting. And then I'll take a lighter color. Okay, I gotta go. I gotta go get Lachlan. And I'll do like this sort of thing just to give it like a, like a snowy flavor. Anyway, I'm gonna keep working on this. Work on your snowflake. Make it interesting. Put some lines in here. I made the center too big, I think. All right, so uh, one more thing, one more thing, one more thing. At a certain point, you can start introducing other colors. Look at this. You're not going to see this on the screen, but it's starting to really feel like spatial because of this extra color in there. And I'm just going to put a little bit of this light color on my lines, like just kind of scribble scrabble on the background. It gives it like a little bit of a depth. Oh, it's smearing a little though. That's okay. Anyway, you'll, you'll see it when you do it. Get a light color crayon. Like this is an apricot. Oh, I love apricots. Apricot soaked in honey. Um, okay, so do this. Get a couple of different colors, maybe even white. That'll give it a nice kind of snowy look. It's not bad. And uh, I don't know, that's too dark. Orange, that's way too dark. I don't have a lighter color. This is a light, what is this? Burnt orange, whoa. I never heard of a color called burnt orange. All right, but anyway, do that. Make a snowflake. I don't know how it looks on the screen, but here it looks really interesting. Okay, I gotta go get Lachlan. I'm gonna make another video later. I'll do more snowflakes. I'm gonna do a video with a composition of snowflakes. It's gonna be cool. All right, I'll see you guys later. I gotta go get Lachlan.